What it do, family? It's your girl, 2D2, and I am back with another video. Shout out to the squad, s and Drip Set, what it do. I appreciate you guys for coming back and tuning in. I love you the long way I do. Look, you know the vibes. I need you to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and please watch those ads. Smash it! Smash that subscribe button. Do it on the Twitch and do it on YouTube. Do it right now, right this second. Listen, my name is Tamika, a.k.a. 2. Welcome to my reaction channel. I appreciate everybody for tapping in with 2. Now, look, we're about to get into this Chris Sales. He's doing it again. Nurse, he's out again. Like for real, evidence that uh, Clarence cheats on Queen. I usually, you know what I'm saying, I hee hee ha ha at Chris because um, I genuinely wanted this dude to come back on YouTube with another wave, but some things never change. Um, I don't know if the title is clickbait. I don't know if it's clickbait. I don't know if the video is clickbait, but we about to go and check it out. So without further ado, let's slide into this vid. Let's go. What's good, YouTube? I am back. Oh my God, listen. Listen. Let me set this right here real quick. I am back, man. Come on, man. Come on, don't. Listen, 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 listen. Okay. This is an apology uh, video, right? So listen, listen, listen. Hey, like first of all, I wanna, I wanna apologize to Clarence for saying he, you know, he was cheating. It's because I cheated on me, he cheated. You know what I'm saying? And I was wrong, like I was wrong for saying, like he, you know, you know, he cheated. Cause I feel like at the Y'all, this nigga's the biggest troll in the United States of America. Oh my God, I'm sorry, y'all. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, <laughs> y'all. This nigga here, y'all, dog, this dude is the biggest troll on the whole YouTube show. I can't even, I can't even. First of all, look at the money. Now he's doing this because he's like, a lot of people in the video be saying that he's broke and that he need cream. He's doing this to basically bait y'all. You feel what I'm saying? So, exactly. Now you see why I was black on y'all end. Y'all gonna thank me later. Y'all gonna wish y'all just heard the audio of this shit. But it's gonna get worse. Because look at his face when he's apologizing, y'all. So listen, listen, listen. Like, first of all, I wanna, I wanna apologize to Clarence for saying he, you know, he was cheating. It's because I cheated on me, he cheated. You know what I'm saying? And I was wrong. Like I was wrong for saying like he, you know, you know he cheated. Cause I feel like at the end of the day, like that was just wrong of me. And as a man, I take full responsibility for my actions. Listen, he takes full responsibility why he's on a video titled Evidence Clarence Cheats on Queen. With the monkey face hiding the face and the goddamn loving emojis. You can't make this type of shit up, y'all. You feel me? This is why I be trying to tell a lot of people, like, you know how when you at a barbecue and, and, and that you down to that last rib that you trying to fuck up? You feel me? And then that gnat is just everywhere, bro, and you trying to hit that bitch? Yo, you got to understand that Chris is that gnat to niggas, bro. Like, he is going to aggravate niggas. Man, all right, let's go, let's go. Um, I'm trying to, I'm trying to, I'm trying to be a better person. <laughs> Lexi Lex, I just told him that shit yesterday. I said, if is anybody who knows how to make somebody come to his video after being gone for three years, bro, it is going to be this man right here. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He childish, man. All right, all right. Really not making this video because I need to pay my rent today. I mean, on the first. I'm sorry. I need to pay my rent. Well, you know what? He ain't lying about that. Y'all sub up because the rent going to be coming up, and I need y'all to smash that side. <laughs> That's probably the only thing I agree with Christopher on. Come on, Christopher. I wanted him to come back to YouTube and do him, not do this. And, you know, it's, it's, been, it's been hard out here. And like, why does bitter baby daddy keep trolling? 
Like, move on. It's been several years. Move on. Stop. Chris, why do you keep talking about talking about them? And my defense is that That's exactly why he's saying it. He read every shade room comment, and that's what his apologies is going towards. This nigga is the biggest troll alive. They mentioned me first. Don't kill the messenger. I'm just, I'm just, I'm an innocent bystander. All I'm gonna say is, listen, all I gotta say, don't mess with me. Like I've been doing good. Like I y'all y'all know this. Like y'all know this for a fact. Y'all not gonna wanna admit it, but I've been doing perfectly fine. I've been chilling. I haven't been on social media. I've been sitting out the way. I don't do YouTube anymore. But y'all forcing Chris Hill to come back to social media. And I, I didn't want to. I didn't want to. Trust me. It's not me who, who wants to do this. It's the, it's the Illuminati. The Illuminati. I signed a deal with the Illuminati. And they making me do these things. Because Queen came out with a song. So every time Queen come out with music, I have to troll. Because it's free promotion. You get what I'm saying? It's free promotion for her. And if I don't, my life will be at risk. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, please sub to my, my sub to my channel right now so I can get better money. So I don't have to react to this nigga. Cause this nigga here is crazy. He's childish, bro. See, you, you gotta grow up, Christopher. I want this man to grow up so bad, dog. My life will be at risk if I don't troll. You feel me? And I just want y'all to know. What you say? Stop playing with me, bro. Alright. But let me first start off. If you don't mention me, I won't mention you. Like y'all, y'all, y'all fail to realize this is for all the viewers right now. If you don't mention me, I won't mention you. I've seen a video they kept tagging me in. It's cool when they do it. It's a problem when I do it. Fuck, fuck. And listen. People, I, listen, the last statement I made when I said Clarence was in cop, constant that party, who went out to the girl, I don't pillow talk about nobody. Even my friends know I don't care about none of that. See, this is the thing, man. This is the thing that's sick me about this situation. You know what I'm saying? I can understand, nigga, YouTubers gonna be YouTubers. I understand you got to do what you got to do to get that bag. I also understand, nigga, just being a positive motherfucker ain't going to sell. Um, this nigga going to have way more views than me in the last three years combined just off this drama shit. You feel me? I understand that fact. But see, what he don't understand is that he's tarnishing another man, no matter how he wants to play. Because somewhere along the lines and in these comments, it's going to be a sleuth. That's going to go and try to snoop and try to figure out any piece of little thing that they could come up with a concocted of a story for. And, and it's just like he don't understand that the damage that's doing to Clarence as a man, like people be priding themselves off doing the right thing. You feel me? And this is when it goes a little bit too far because it's not about you and him. It's about the people that's on the shade room and those people are consumers. Those people are going to be the ones that's right and that's buying the records and watching the videos and shit. And he just shouldn't do that, bro. That shit's corn is corny as hell. I don't, bro, any of my friends can tell you to this day, I swear to God on my kids, I don't care about none of that. But I am going to tell you guys because I feel like I need content and I need to pay my rent. I need to pay my rent. But when, when somebody told me that I did a video with this certain individual girl, right? And when we did the video, she came to my house. And she told me she was at cost that party. And see, then it's making it very messy for Abby Nicole, too. Now, see, everybody know if you followed them a long time ago, like, Abby Nicole has already had a situation going back and forth for Queen, Clarence, my, the guy. Y'all remember the highlighter shit. You know what I'm saying? Or whatever. So this is what I'm saying. Like, she pretty much lended out her hand to bring him on her channel. You feel what I'm saying? Now, even if she did tell him stuff in confidence, it's like, bro, why would you do that? Because now you're, you're blocking another bridge. You know what I'm saying? This girl is with all your whole people. So you might can probably get that, uh, you know what I'm saying, fixing that relationship a lot quicker. But when you do stuff like this, you burning bridges with everybody. And that's what he shouldn't do. Unless she told him to go ahead and say what, what he want to say. I mean. I'm like, okay, that's cool. And she said, guess who was there? I'm like, who? She was like, Clarence. Now look, what I'm about to show y'all, this is how buddy gonna be after I show y'all this. Spell red. What? L-S-T-E-R. 
And I was like, oh, okay, cool. Like, what you telling me for? She was like, yeah. And she's the one who told me the information. You feel me? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna disclose that who told me. But she's the one who told me. And I just listened. I, I wasn't, it's not like I was gossiping. Oh, yeah, what else he do? What else? I don't give a f If you know me, you have to know me to know I don't give a f But on social media, it looks like I give a fuck because I need my bills paid. I get it. Notice he's saying this with a pouch full of money, bro. This nigga gotta be stopped, dog. Okay, clap it up. I need my best pay. And I'm this bitter baby daddy, and I want my ex back, and, and I want my ex back, and I love her so much, and I just watch her every day, and I just can't wait to be back with her after I show y'all this. After I show you guys this, you feel me? So what I'm about to tell, what I'm about to show y'all right now, all I got to say is, uh, Clarence, <laughs> You better pack light. If you don't get your shit together, you might have to. Did the nigga put his toe in the camera, y'all? <laughs> did the nigga put his feet in the camera too, Shotty? Like, did, did, is, his, is his toe in the camera? Like, dog, hold on, bro. Do he really got the... <laughs> Can y'all all look at the toe? Can you look at the toe right now, please? Can you look at the toe? This nigga is different, y'all. If you don't get your shit together, you might have to pack life. Um, sing with me, y'all. Pack life. <laughs> Before I show you guys this, listen, don't, don't be mad at me. Don't, matter of fact, be mad at me. <laughs> Cause I don't, I don't, I really, from the bottom of my heart, I don't care. See, see, what Chris don't realize is that this the type of shit you do when you don't have children involved. Now see, this is where it gets a little bit iffy. Because first of all, you got another man, right? That's um that plays a part in helping your son being raised. So when you do this type of shit like this, bro, you complicate not only one situation but many others. And see what he don't understand is that even with Jazz and Armand and all of the rest of his homies and shit, they don't want him doing this themselves. So if if forever just keeps the shit. I don't know, man. Chris, I guess he he fine with being by himself, bro. Because this nigga, if, if if I don't need nobody in the world, it was a person. It's Chris. Everybody being mad at me, what that's going to do for me? I don't care. Listen, the thing is, I don't care if people like me. You know why? Because the people who wants to be liked so much will do anything and say anything to make people like them. Me, I'm the type of person I'm going to say what's on my mind and I'm going to say the truth. That's the difference between your favorite YouTuber, the people you watch. They gonna tell you what you want to hear so you can keep watching them and keep liking them. Me on the other hand, I've been a villain for so long, I don't give a fuck. You know, I don't. I, don't. I really don't. And I'm sorry I'm posting this. I'm just a messy girl. I'm, I'm, I'm a messy girl now. For now on, this is gonna be a T page, okay? This is not gonna be no Chris Sales vlogs and blah, blah, blah. This is gonna be a Chris Hill's T page. Matter of fact, tell Zoe, somebody go tag Zoe and tell him we need to collab on Messy Monday. Cause that's what we gonna do. We gonna collab on Messy Monday. Tell Zoe I'm taking over Messy Monday on God. What you talking about, nigga? I don't even know where to begin because the information I have is just so like, should I show it? Should I not show it? Should I? Chris is like a black 6'9". Like, Straight up. This nigga's like a black 6'9". I at this moment, man, I was really rooting for this. I don't think nothing can save Chris at this point. I show it. Should I not show it? And I'm only gonna do this right because Clarence, as y'all see, he posted this post. Trying to play victim. Like he wasn't trolling me for years. 
Like, stay-at-home mom was not trolling me for years. You feel me? Like, he's been trolling me for so long, even down to the part where... I remember he made a video in a bathtub about me. I remember on Halloween, he dressed up as me. He said, I'm Chris Hill. Blah, blah, blah. I remember the last video they made on YouTube was they said, mention me. And I be doing so good. I be home peacefully, making my bread. When I was reacting to the video, and I mean, they didn't mention him in a very derogatory way. As a matter of fact, Clarence really didn't even comment on it like that. It was more so Queen saying that she didn't have a problem with the exes dating. But I knew when I was reacting to that video, I said, this nigga, Chris, I thought it would be on you. I thought it would be on Instagram because I felt a little bit of a relief because I said the nigga ain't on YouTube. But I knew what they said in that video was going to come back. Because this nigga here is still talking about when Clarence was in the tub. My nigga, it was like five and a half years ago. You got Chris, stop. You feel me chilling? And I'm just this bitter baby daddy. I'm just this bitter baby daddy. When you baby mama get a new boyfriend. Fuck you and your new nigga. His snapback, Dusty. You would never get this again because your ass crack must I should have never with you. I'll smack him in the shit if he tell my son what to do. It's up and it's stuck with you. I know your leech and borrow money from my cousin too. After all this shit I've been through, you trying to take the child support money to go buy swimsuits? I swear to God, don't none of you just think. That's why I gave your friend back shots on your kitchen sink. When we was together, all I did was cheat. I'm Kayla, Keisha, Maya, Chrissy, and Tiffany. It's better, baby, Well, listen up. We're not, we're not, we, this is not about me. And I, I, I want to be anonymous. So. Shook, to be honest, is is not funny. It's not funny at all. You know what I'm saying? But the thing about it is, I, what do you do at this point? I mean, all you can do is laugh because bless Queen's heart. Because you just do not want to see this type of shit when you're basically, when, when you're promoting something new. You don't want this in your life. So T-Room, if you post this, I want to stay anonymous. Don't tell people I, I gave you all this information. Please don't. Say you got it from somebody else. Say you got it from, I don't know. Okay? Oh, yeah, I do the things I do because I want clout. That's that's another thing. I, I need clout. Like, I fiend for it. You feel me? Like, I fiend for clout. Like, if I don't have clout in my life, I don't know what I want. This nigga is pulling an eight mile. Clarence parents had a real good marriage. He is putting everything out here. So people don't have nothing to say in his comment section. Now, from a business perspective, it's smart as a motherfucker. From a from a personal perspective, it's like Chris is being dad, dog. What the fuck, man? Like I just don't know what I would do if I didn't have color. Then the nigga got the Jumanji hat on. He gotta be stopped. The nigga gotta be stopped. In my life, like I, like I need that. You know how a, a fiend need they pipe? You know how a fiend need they needles? Like I need clout. Like it just does something to me. You feel me? But look, man, we gonna get into the video. Um, for those who are here, please don't call me messy if you watching this video because you are messy because you clicked on this video because you wanted to see some some. You wanted to see that tea. So for those who, who who's on this video right now, I bet I see one not 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 a not a not a messy comment under this post. Because you know what you were doing when you clicked on this video. Claire said I hate him. I don't hate you, bro. Like I'm not even gonna lie to you. Like like this is the honest God truth. Like I'm I'm like I can't be no more serious than this, right? I feel like, and, and, I, and, and everybody will agree with me to this. Bro, if we did a boxing match, bro, I swear to God. I swear to God, bro, we will make a million each. We will make probably more than a million dollars. I'm not even lying to you. If we did a boxing match, bro. This, this nigga's annoying, but he is not lying. People would pay for that because people don't really care about positive shit. Niggas would cash out on that on that boxing match. And I ain't gonna lie, I would be the first motherfucker to probably give him my money because I wanna watch. You feel me? I wanna watch. Five years of pissing me off too. You know what I'm saying? All the people in my comment section going crazy. So yes, at this point, I feel like I'm involved. I would love to see it. Now it would be a healthy way. 
to where they could be able to raise some money and get some fucking money, man, and, and do it without having to be ignorant. You feel me? Or you could just do just what Clarence do and just not pay this nigga no money. <laughs> but I will, I will watch that. Drop it in the, in the comments if you'll watch. And I swear to God, bro, you can hear me right now. If, if, it, if it sounds good to you, a million dollars don't sound good to you, it's money, bro. But listen, if we did a boxing match, bro, do you know how stupid that would go, bro? If you watch this video, bro, I don't hate you. You my twin. They say we look alike. We both cheaters. I mean, we don't know if you're a cheater yet until we see evidence. But um, I'm just saying, don't shoot the messenger. Don't, don't come for me. Do not come for me, please don't. Oh, by the way, I I, I fucking I, I fucking forgot. Yes, I'm wearing the same jeans. <laughs> I'm wearing the same jeans. Is the famous jeans? I had to throw it on for this video. You know I had to. I had to. I had to throw the jeans. Let the jeans get some glorification. <laughs> I don't even know if that's a word, but come on now. Let the jeans do. You feel me? I had to throw on the jeans just for this video. But yeah, a boxing. It's not funny, but it's funny. It's almost like a spoof. Like, don't be a menace by drinking gin or juice in the hood. It's like one of them shits. It's like, bro. That's what goes stupid. I'm stupid. If you're not scared, I mean, I remember last time you told me you didn't want to box me. I mean, I don't know. Like, I, like I'm trying to box somebody. Nobody wants blue face. I want to. I want to box blue face. I will box Daryl, I think that's his name, Daryl DDG. I will box Clarence, I will box, bro, anybody. Only person I'm not boxing is Jake Paul. Jake Paul, you got it. I'm, I'm not even gonna lie to you. He probably gonna be my, not gonna lie to you. Let's get on to the story. This is my evidence, this is my truth. And I'm only putting this because I need to pay my rent. I, I, I need to pay my rent this month, yes. I need to pay my rent and I need some money, but, okay, okay let's get into it. Let's, Drop it down in the comments. Now, I, grown people. Now, you know from a YouTube or business perspective, you can view this a lot of different ways. But I want to know in the comment section. Because, I mean, I'm laughing at them because at this point, you got to, I mean, what the fuck? You feel what I mean? But I really want to know, do you think this type of shit do uh, Chris more harm than good? I mean, granted, he might have a nice little bag this month. But then next month, you got to be able to continue to be able to, to make your money. So I'm asking y'all. Do you think that videos like this do him more harm than good? I want to know. Because this, 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 this is interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm very, very, very much like okay. interested in this video. You feel me? Okay, so when I went viral on the shade room, right? When the shade room posted me, obviously y'all know. My fans know they don't post anything about me. Bro, shade room teams don't even post my birthday anymore. This is how, this is how much they don't like me. They don't post my... They, they don't post my birthday anymore. They used to post my birthday. They don't post it anymore. Only time Shay Room is going to post me is if I mention my ex or Clarence. So I'm going to give them what they want because, like I said, I'm addicted to cop. Like, I need cop. Like, I, I, I need it. Like, it's like a drug for me. Like, I need it. Like, I want to be famous so bad. Like, I just need it. Like, I need to be famous. Because if I'm not famous, it's just like, I don't know what I'm going to do with my life. I don't know my next life. I'm going to be a cheater or something. And then if I'm a cheater. Shade Room posted me, right, y'all? Shade Room posted me. The sad shit is, I was really rude for this nigga the second time around. I ain't even going to lie. Even when people was like, toot, he ain't never going to change. And I felt that. I mean, y'all know I'm grown as hell. Like, I'm, I usually have a really good king. It's just that some people you really try to have a little faith in. And boy, 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 this was not it. This was not it. And they posted Chris Hills thinks Clarence has been cheating on Queen. But I got evidence. What Chris about to say? Is it me or do she? Or her is her arms longer than normal? You feel what I'm I, like? I, I'm I'm not even knowing him. No, like the, when you look at the okay, <laughs> I'm not talking about this lady. Let me start there. But when you look at the length, the area from the elbow to the wrist, that shit is like a horse a horse leg. So is it supposed to be that? 
And this don't got nothing to do with Queen. And I ain't even mentioned Queen name or anything. I, I mean, like, as far as, like, I'm not saying, I don't, I'm not mentioning Queen or anything. You feel me? I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm definitely not. And I'm not going to say I'm not a bitter baby daddy because I'm going to say I am. I'm not going to say I hate Queen because I'll say I do. I'm not going to say anything in this video. Okay? I'm not going to, I'm not going to, I'm not going to say anything. I'm going to let y'all think what y'all want to think because no matter how much I say, I've been over that. Y'all gonna say I am. So I'm not gonna say anything. I'm gonna let y'all decide. So boom, we about to go to the video, right? So Shane Room posted me. This girl messaged me, right? She follows me and everything. She messaged me. Like, who told you that? So in my mind, I'm thinking like, why you wanna know who told me? that Clarence cheated, or he supposedly had cheated when he went to a car party, or yacht party, whatever it is. Like, why would you want to, like, why do you want to know who told me that so bad? You feel me? And she was like, because, like, she was like, just who told you? And I'm like, all right, I, I know he cheated. I'm like, Like, I know these things. I never said anything because I didn't care. You feel me? In the video, I don't say anything. But she was like, who told me? And the girl that did me was the one who slept with Clarence. So I'm just playing stupid, like, why you want to know so bad? Why do you want to know? And she's like, who, you know? I just, I just don't, as a man, I don't even understand why he would even be, let's say hypothetically it did happen. But as a man, I mean, you going to report on another man? Yo, that's top tier, bro. Who told you? Because I fell out with my best friend, and I'm trying to see if she told you. I'm like, no. Her best friend didn't tell me. Her best friend didn't tell me. Somebody else told me. So she was like, okay. She just kept trying to figure out who told me that he cheated and what's the name. So I'm like... All right, I'm gonna play your game, cause I know you did it. I don't know if it was you. Why would you sleep with a with a married man? But when you ask Clarence why they didn't get married, this is his response right here. What's your favorite position? Well, boyfriend and girlfriend right now. We just we've been together. We've been together going on two years. Uh, married. I'm proud of them. But why would you? Why would you try and go and sleep with a married man? Like that is that is. I don't, I, I don't, hey, don't shoot the message. Boy, we 17 minutes in on a 24 minute video and, and we still ain't had seen no receipts. So it looks like he's definitely back on it again. However, uh, five minutes of it is memes and shit, which is hella funny. Um, it's, it's helping the video, to be honest. Messenger, do not shoot the messenger. I'm just, I'm just saying my thoughts. Yeah, she can, she can. He getting his views. You ain't mad at boy. You can't be mad at that. Like, that's one thing he gonna do is get dumb. Why would you go sleep with a man that you know he got a girlfriend? These females is out to him. She must have no morals anymore. No morals. Okay? All right, bet. So, we go on and say, I, I, just, I just end up telling her. Like, bro, I know you had sex with him. I didn't mention your name. You know, I didn't mention your name. And she was like, yeah, I don't know. But who told you? She still want to know who told me that I knew that she had sex with clients at consummate party. She was just, she was just so eager to find out. And I just never told her. I still never told her. But I am going to post the uh, screen record. You really can't. You can't be mad. Because Chris, one thing about Chris, Chris going to give you who he is. And it ain't like he been any different for the last four years, so you can't even really be mad. But hold on, let's look into this. We finally got a receipt. 
After 19 minutes, we finally got a receipt. I'm so confused as to why, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm so confused as to why you talking on business that doesn't pertain to you. I just want to know where you heard about that from. I don't care about the rest. Someone told me, who? Why does it matter? Laughing out loud. What what you want for it? Cause I want to know if, if it was a specific person. My ex best friend who was at the, uh, was on the yacht with me. Her pillow talking ass. Um, I know y'all fuck laughing out loud, but I ain't say your name. Appreciate that, but I still want to know who said it to you. Who's your best friend? Lena. Not my friend for months. How she look? This girl. Oh, no, somebody else told me. I'm about to train record. Y'all watch that. And for everybody who kept saying, shut up, Chris. He's faithful and when you're not. Listen. The T pages is in that girl's inbox right now as we speak. You feel me? Somebody's trying to get that goddamn exclusive interview with her. But see, the thing about it is, bro, how do you how do you say you want peace and, and you don't want to speak on certain people and you don't want certain karmas, but you just coming back on YouTube and you actually just fucking up a whole family? I mean, let's just be real about it. Like, I mean, regardless of what you want to label Queen and Clarence, the motherfuckers got a whole mortgage together you feel me and they're raising kids and one of them just happened to be yours so if you're gonna show somebody grace you should show them respect just off that alone for you to come back on youtube but be on the same shit you was when you left is not really showing no growth and anybody who say that can see that is just lying you feel me like dead ass serious and that's just all i can say about that listen i don't even i don't even fly in <laughs> Somebody just messaged me, I swear to God. Talking about some man F on all that shit with the clearance. I got the drop on him right now at Sandy Springs Lifetime Fitness. Clarence, is that where you at right now? See, listen, I don't come like I don't be worried about y'all. This all that comes to me. Look, I'm about to screenshot it right now. This is what comes to me. I'm a show. This is what comes to me. I'm going to show you on the screen. This is the stuff that comes to me. And see, that type of shit is fucking dangerous. I mean, now you putting out where that man be. You feel me? And we seen when motherfucking Takashi was just in the fitness thing. It don't be your ignorant ass. It be these so-called supporters. They feeling like they helping you by doing shit like that. But see, bro, that's a whole different ball game right there. God forbid if this man is at the gym and somebody jump on this man and some shit like that because he only trying to play basketball and something happened, nigga is going to come back and look at you for that type of shit. So you got to be careful. Like, it's one thing I understand niggas want views and stuff, bro, but you shouldn't let views, you know what I'm saying, overshadow your character, bro. That's what your characters was going to take you farther. Views, that shit, this right here, this is only temporary. You know what I'm saying? Three days from now, niggas ain't going to remember none of this video. So you have to ask yourself, is what I'm causing worth that? And I just don't think it is, to be honest. So y'all can't say Chris is... Oh, he's just so stuck on his ex and... No, I don't... Bro, I don't think about this person. I don't think about none of my exes. Like, if it's not money or my kids, I don't... Don't give a fuck. So the biggest question is, if you don't care, then why do this video? You know what I mean? Like, you came back... Like, you said what you said in your, first, in your other video that I reacted to, that you felt like the man cheated, and then you already gave a rundown of this situation. For you to come back, you know what I'm saying, the next day on another video, 24 minutes, because you need to put at least about 25 ads in this video, and you know niggas is going to click on something that say evidence Clarence cheats on Queen, bro, it, it's just, it, to me, I just feel like you have lo a lot more money in the long run not going this route. But this is all, y'all just, y'all heard my phone go off, y'all seen this, I'm showing y'all proof right now. This is stuff that comes to me. I can't stress that enough. Like, I don't go searching for this stuff. I'm home chilling, 
Half of the time I'm in my game, I'm at, I'm at the studio, I'm working out. I don't know if I'm on Jada Wedo or Ruby Rose. Like I don't I don't know. Like I'm trying to figure that out still. But you feel me? Like all of this stuff comes to me. Like I don't come searching for it. Y'all know that. And y'all, I think y'all know deeper down inside, like, people do be sending Chris stuff. People do be spamming him. So he have no choice but to see the stuff. I know y'all know this. I know y'all know this stuff. I know Chris after seven years selling that home, searching up, searching up this, searching. How y'all wanna take it? If y'all still think he's faithful, then he's faithful. If y'all think he's a cheater, he's a cheater. If y'all think nothing of him, he's nothing. If y'all like him, y'all like him. If y'all hate him, y'all hate him. I'm not trying to tell y'all how to go about liking him or hating him. I'm not saying that. All I'm saying is, I need my rent pay. <laughs> You feel me? Clarence, if you watching this, it's no shade, no hate to you, brother. I hope you react to this video because I got more stuff. As soon as you react to <laughs>